a taping for quadratus lumborum imbalance. First things first, where is the QL or the quadratus lumborum? So it originates on the posterior iliac crest at the back of the pelvis. It then inserts into the spine at the transverse processes of L1 to L4 and into the last rib. So it creates this square four-sided muscle. In terms of its actions then, as it contracts, if it does so bilaterally, so on both sides at the same time, we get lumbar extension. One side at a time, we get lateral flexion of the vertebral column. It can laterally tilt the pelvis when used together, and it also fixes the last rib in breathing. So if there's any dysfunction, any restriction in that muscle, it can impact a number of things, from pelvic problems, spine pain, lower back pain, right through to breathing dysfunction. In particular here, we're talking about QL imbalance, so where we have one that is shorter, more dominant than the other. But equally, you may see clients with issues in both QLs. For example, in a lordotic posture, postnatal posture, where both QLs have become short, tight, overworked, and are causing problems in the body. In this case, looking at imbalance, so one-sided, what we might see is a rotational element in that pelvis, and that might give away that there's an issue with the QL. This is really common in society and in your client base. Golfers, always I see this one-sided dominance, but also moms carrying a child on one side, people carrying heavy bags on one side, or people who simply work in a rotational fashion, laptop to one side, etc, etc. And what we want to do is help get them out of that rotation and try to get them pain-free. So, how can kinesiology tape help? So what we're going to do is inhibit the short dominant side, which will help to keep it open relaxed post treatment or on its own while we do the work to correct that imbalance in the pelvis and spine. Other options you might look at is to activate the longer weaker QL, or you can combine with other tapings to address global issues. For example, in the case of pelvic rotation, where we may also want to inhibit um, the same side hip flexor or activate, for example, the glute on that side as well. So let's look at the kinesiology taping technique to inhibit the QL on one side. I'm going to use a 10 centimeter piece of tape here, but you could use five centimeter or two five centimeters, but the posterior iliac crest is quite wide, so I want to cover the whole of that origin. So first things first, I'm going to anchor. We want to inhibit, we want to lengthen away. So I'm going to um, ad um, adhere the tape on the origin. Now I'm gonna peel back the middle of the tape, the active piece, and for inhibition, I'm going to add a light amount of stretch and get my client to side bend, reach away to put the tissue on stretch. Rub the tissue down to stick. Get your client to relax the tissue and simply anchor the tape with no pressure. <laughs> 